so next we are going to look at shift left resistor so i'm going to write over here shift left resistor so we are going to copy this as it is and we are going to see what actually changes okay so let's see oops okay i have it over here i do not need this and i need to complete this like this this is your q3 okay now what changes is this was initially your serial out but in this case this becomes your serial in okay so this is my serial in over here and what happens is this becomes my serial out so i'm going to take this off i'm going to write over here sorry not this but this the output of first register or q0 becomes my serial out okay so this is my serial out and my arrows changes like this sorry even this is not serial in your serial in is going to be the input of first register okay so your serial in is over here like this this is your serial in okay and what changes is instead of a arrow from q2 to d3 we have an arrow from q3 to d2 okay like this similarly instead of q1 to d1 what i have is q2 to d1 okay and similarly over here instead of q0 to d1 what i have is a arrow from or a output of q1 to input of d0 so this is my shift left resistor okay you get your output final output from the first flip flop q0 you can also create it like this this is equivalent to let's let's do it like this i have four flip flops okay and i am going to change the notations of q and d in my flip flop okay what i am going to do is i am going to write it like this i have d over here i have q and q bar like this d over here q and q bar like this d over here q and q bar like this and finally for this so let's see what is happening now i am going to give my serial input to this d okay the same thing over here you are giving serial input to the first flip flop so this is my serial input okay and what you are doing is you are connecting q3 to d of next so it's very simple now it is like this over here it is like this over here it is like this and you are taking your output from the first flip flop q of first flip flop so here you have your output okay i call this serial out so both of these